What's up, YouTube? I'm back. Make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, man. I've been busy doing other adventures, but I'm back. We got to talk about Stevie A. Smith. Man, shout out to Stevie A. Smith for going on the, uh, the Paul Pierce. The Paul Pierce, uh, not Paul Pierce, uh, what's the damn boy's name? Paul George Park at the Paul George talk shit about it. Shout out to him for uh, going up there and encouraging. But anyway, Stephen A. Smith on the podcast has told uh, people that Rich Paul, Rich Paul said that it's disrespectful that Stephen A. Smith got LeBron James number second behind George. It's an insult. I told him it was an insult. How the hell that's an insult? What's an insult for this fake ass goat debate that y'all married up for the last 20, not 20, but well, he been leaving 20, but the last, probably the last 10 years, this fake ass goat debate. Bro, let's just sum it like this. Jordan got 10 scores and titles to LeBron James won. Le Michael Jordan made 19 first all defense to LeBron James five. And Michael Jordan got Six championships, six and zero to LeBron James, losing six championships. What are we talking about here? What are we talking about here, ladies and gentlemen? We got a man that's six and zero in the finals versus a man that's four and six in the finals. What are we talking about? We got a man that averaged thirty points for a career to a nigga that averaged twenty-seven. We got a nigga that averaged thirty-seven one season, back to average thirty-five another season to a nigga that high scoring average only thirty-one point. What are we talking about here? Like, what are we talking about? Like, what are we talking about? I'm in traffic right now, but what, what are we talking about? Like, what disrespect? What is this, what, what disrespectful for him to be in the same sentence as Jordan? He don't deserve the same. The only the only why I even entertain it because I believe Michael Jordan played some weak ass competition. I believe Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, Kobe Bryant been needed playing against the most competition because Michael Jordan they say Michael Jordan a great defender but he didn't play against incredible shooting guards uh, three guards a, a, a point guards a week right I give LeBron that I, I, I see LeBron all because that's why I say it's stupid pat errors that's the only thing I can just and that's got nothing to do, and that knock I got against Jordan got nothing to do with Jordan Jordan didn't make the niggas he played against but I did see Kobe Bryant and LeBron James play against tougher competition I 100% agree and there's no argument for a Jordan fan to even try to compare. Like, who, who are you gonna say, John John Starks, uh, Hornacek, and uh, uh, Charles Barkley and them Dominique Wilkins? Like, it's better than the the, the Kobe's, the T Max, the LeBrons, the Steph Curry, the Allen Iverson, the Paul Pierce, the Dwayne Wade, the Carmelo Anthony's, the Paul George, the Brandon Wards, the uh, Vince Carter's. Jordan didn't play against some guys, right? So that so we so that's the only. Only reason why I entertain this argument because LeBron James played against incredible the Kevin Durant, the Western Westbrook, all these guys. Kobe and LeBron played against. They played it in the era where everybody wants everybody uh, adapted Michael Jordan style and start implementing, start playing like that. Right? Michael Jordan didn't face the guy like that. He was there, and the closest guy on that team was Scottie Pippen. That was and played with his teammates were. So we have to. I take that into consideration. But when I look at a total standpoint, dominating, winning, and skill set. LeBron could not fuck with Jordan on any level. They could talk about passing. I don't give a F about passing. Shannon Sharp once sit on undisputed table and said he don't care about defense. The same way Shannon Sharp said he don't care about defense, I don't give a damn about passing the basketball. And Michael Jordan averaged five and six for his career. So miss me with that shit. He's guarding the shooting guard, shoot the ball. He played his role. He's not LeBron James' assistant and want to control the every fucking thing. That's not Mike or Kobe. Their job is not to be a point guard, a, 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 shoot, a, shoot, a, sh a shooting guard. They're looking to score the basketball when help when help come and it's time to pass. They pass the ball, so that's that's a non-argument starter for me right there. I don't I don't take that shit serious whatsoever at all. I don't take that shit serious at all. That pass the ball, that shit is uh, and, and rebounds. A nigga is a front line player. LeBron said, "Them two things, you can just shut the fuck up. You can just shut the f up forever for that." With them two arguments y'all like to put against uh uh when LeBron pass the ball, brother, you'll see. I don't give a two flying f's about that. I care about defense and offense. Defense and offense. Them two guys I just named got them things better over LeBron. Kobe better scoring and a better defender shows Michael Jordan. It is laughable. It is the niggas are not scared of LeBron. Once or all, but once or all. Niggas are not scared of LeBron. Niggas niggas ain't even niggas ain't LeBron don't even have him in a top ten. Niggas don't like like 
shit is remarkable and crazy. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a it's a debate. Like like what like what debate? He didn't even dominate his era. Kevin Steph Curry got the same line championship. Kevin Durant ate. Everybody ate. Who ate? Who ate doing Michael Jordan? Nobody ate. Y'all like subscribe, comment, share the video. Tell me. See you on next week. Peace.